Hello, welcome back to PAC Outdoors. This is the second part of my cook system uh, series and I have um, for your entertainment, um, hopefully your, your laughter, um, the Crusader cook set. So there's the cooker and I have inside there some uh, coiled fire or stove rope um, which a YouTuber um, discovered actually increases the <coughs> the boil the, the burn time for um, for methylated spirits. Um, I have the Crusader cup, which is bomb proof. Both these items are stainless steel. Um, absolutely fantastic with the handle. As you can see, it's had plenty of use. And I've got a windbreak, little um, five plate aluminium windbreak. So. Um, I'm conscious that my battery's running out on the uh, on the phone, so I'm going to just pour 20, 250 millilitres of water into the Crusader for a brew. I don't have the Osprey uh, Crusader cup yet, but I'm um, probably going to get that. And there are increments in there. A 250 milliliter mark and a 500 milliliter half uh, liter mark, so that's helpful. I've also got some larch, dry larch cones, which I uh, found on the woodland floor as I was walking up here to um, to try. Maybe we'll see. Um, here's my meths. There's two ounces in there. Um, there's, there's two markings. The one signifies one ounce, and the other one two. Um, that was just to help me. Um, just put an ounce in there. Uh, I think I should be able to boil 250 millilitres with half an ounce um, of meths, uh, which is about 15 millilitres, I think. I'm going to put a full ounce in. Just pour it over the rope. Just a little bit more. Is an ounce. I haven't got my fire steel, so I'm just going to start that with with a match. Don't know whether the camera is picking that up, but um, it's it's going quite well. Put the Crusader cook her arm over. I'm just going to place the uh, my foil lid on top of the cup. And put the cup on there and see if we can get a, a rolling boil. What I might do periodically is um, is put uh, the odd cone on there to see whether that um, that makes any difference. It's not that breezy today, um, but I purchased this this sort of Andes um, wind um, brake for a couple of pounds off eBay, and it's really really good. This is the pouch which I've shown you before on part one that the. PCB um, Crusader cook set goes in. Like I said, I don't have the Osprey um, water bottle yet, but uh, I'm working on that. So we'll see. Um, we'll see how we go with this. In here is my mess penny stove. That I will also try at some point. It's very, very, very good. Very efficient. So I carry that in the pack as well. So we'll see how uh, long it takes us to get uh, to get some bubbles on a rolling boil. So I've been filming now for um, just under five minutes. So if we assume that's been going for a minute. Coming up to five minutes, um, we'll have a good indication how long this is taking. There's quite a, 
there's quite an odour coming off off the mess so just just be aware of that it's not the nicest smell in the world but uh, this fire rope certainly um, certainly helps with the burn time just see if we've got any, any bubbling going on that is very hot I would advise wearing gloves when you do this sort of thing Yeah, we've got some bubbles, very small ones. I'll try uh, just the pine cone on there to see um, whether that will actually burn. It's actually a large cone. They're very dry. Yeah, I can see those. Uh, see those starting to burn. I'm sure you can too. This system is very very versatile and uh, if you can keep the wind off off the burner it is actually uh, got a, got a built-in windshield but um, it's not that great. The new design is, uh, has got a bigger housing um, which supposedly is more is more efficient. See how long that takes. This Crusader cup has um, has given me a lot of service. Uh, I use it to, to, to boil water in, to drink out of, to eat out of. Um, it's fantastic. I don't know if you can hear the. Uh, the hot air inside the, the, the Crusader, but um, I think we're going to have um, quite a few bubbles in there at the moment from the sound of it. You can probably hear the tractor in the background, so apologies for that, but this is uh, this is rural Herefordshire and it's rather beautiful. I actually sat in a wood, a bluebell wood, um, surrounded by bluebells, um, which is about a 10 minute walk from my house. Um, I don't own the wood, um, but I feel like I do. <laughs> Supplementing the meths with these these cones. That is very hot. And there we have we have plenty of uh, little bubbles in there. We don't have anywhere near a boil yet but I don't think we're going to be far away and we've been going for three minutes I think maybe a bit longer may have un un underestimated the amount of time I can see steam coming up through the little holes that I've put inside the uh, plastic foil there With an ounce of meths, um, I have had a t 10 minute uh, burn time. So, uh, should be plenty of um, plenty of fuel there to, uh, to boil. 250 millilitres of water. Here we go, we have, we have what is looking like a rolling boil. Well, the start of it after four and a half minutes. So when the conditions are, are, are good, it's very, very efficient. It just needs a little bit of protection. You can see now. 
boil. Probably can't hear it because of the tractor, but um, but it's very, 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 very impressive. I think the point. I think the cones would have uh, probably helped, but we'll see. We'll see how long that um, that burns for. I don't run out of battery first. <laughs> Just um, opening up my uh, my brew kit, which I carry in this Osprey pouch. So I've got tea bags, coffee, spork, honey, because I don't like sugar in my drinks. Tea bags, coffee. Um, got some porridge oats. So enough there to uh, to sustain me for a few hours. That's really bubbling. Safe to say that that's a rolling boil. If I take that off, that's where we're at. If I put, uh, a couple more of these on. And I'll keep that boiling just to see, see how long um, that burns for. Hopefully, the battery on my phone won't run out. If it does, I'll, um, I'll I'll give you an update when I uh, when I upload the video when I edit it. That's been burning now for about six minutes. So what I could have done is um, I could have probably have boiled half a litre of water with uh, that amount of fuel. It's still going well, although it's um, it's subsided a bit. But that may be the um, because of the, the cone, the pine. Uh, sorry, the large cones I put on there. So just to recap, that was 250 millilitres of water um, with one ounce of meth, supplemented with some really dry large cones, very small. Um, I think we had a rolling boil within five minutes. Can't be precise. I wasn't really timing it properly, but um, that's that's about average. Um, sometimes I've done it in less time for, for these ideal conditions. If it's windy, then uh, fuel lasts uh, less amount of time, and um, it takes a lot longer. I think that's petering out now. There's not a lot of juice left there. I don't know whether the large uh, cones have actually made much difference. But having said that, they've just ignited again. So I'll put a few more on there just to see how we go. Okay, so there we are. There we have it, the Crusader Cup cook set. Um, one ounce of meths, probably just under an ounce of meths, supplemented with those large cones. And it's still going. Still bubbling, not a rolling boil, but it's still bubbling. Anyway, I'm gonna uh, stop filming now. Um, I'm going to have my brew before I, uh, before I leave this beautiful place and go back home. And um, thank you for watching. Hope that's been useful. It does show that the uh, the Crusader system does work, um, but you can also use this cup, this Crusader stainless cup, on top of um, on top of a gas burner. Uh, it's absolutely bombproof. Very versatile piece of kit. In fact, if I was to choose just one piece of cooking equipment uh, as a utensil to use it would be this I, I, I could just pick one item this would this would be it 
this this cup itself because it will uh, it'll go on the fire. You can hang it over the fire. Um, in fact, I can't show you the little uh, um, attachment I've got to ha to hang it up to use it on a pot hanger because that's what I'm using to um, keep my phone in place at the moment. Well, anyway, thank you for looking and, and for watching. Please feel free to leave any comments, questions, suggestions below, um, and I look forward to uh, to posting. Um, further videos and uh, and watching yours thank you very much